Hey guys, how's it going? Today we're taking a look at the brand new Wii Mini, just released today on December the 7th. This only came out in Canada, so show some love for the Great White North by clicking that like button down below. Essentially what this is, is a $100 stripped down version or basic version of the Wii, which is kind of old school now since you know that Nintendo just came out with a Wii U, so there's a lot of uh, Wii Wiis flying around I guess. But what this basic version is, is it doesn't have internet connection and it doesn't have backwards compatibility with I guess GameCube games and it has no SD slot reader. It's essentially just a stripped down version, basic version. Heck, for a hundred bucks you'd be silly not to buy it um, if you're really into gaming and you're looking for say a Christmas present for your kid, your loved one, whoever you want and you're on a budget, this is definitely something you need to consider. So as we continue with the unboxing, you guys just saw that I pulled out the console. We'll get to that in a second. We also have the power cables and power adapters, as well as the classic Wii sensor. The Wii Mini shares the same controllers as the classic Wii. It has the nunchuck as well as the Wii remote, and those are exactly the same. And it comes in, in my personal opinion, the best uh, color for the remote in that candy gloss finish in red. And you guys can just see that I'm removing the plastic now. So it's pretty much the same as the classic Wii, same controllers, same setup for just reduced pricing. If you guys like to play online, this definitely won't be for you. But if you're just interested in getting to games and like playing those old school Wii games, this is definitely something you need to look at. So when we take the Wii Mini out of the packaging, the first thing I noticed was the build quality. It didn't feel as premium as say the classic Wii and it really reminded me of my old school N64 or PlayStation. It was really light, finicky, cheap plastic, but for a hundred bucks, you know, beggars can't be choosers, I guess. But that's definitely something to keep in mind. And when you take a look at the CD tray, all you have to do is press the button and you can place your CD inside as well as the power button on the left hand side. But let me guys know what you think of the Wii Mini in your comments down below. Please hang on for that giveaway I'm doing. I've just been super busy guys. I'll have that out for you in the next video. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one and I'll catch you guys later.